What's cooking at the Owls' first spring practice of 2009? Well, along with the cheeseburgers, it was the Owls' search for a running back after Jeff Blanchard tore a knee ligament earlier in the week. His backup, Willie Floyd, that's him right there, didn't experience much success, and neither did third stringer Avion Roll. The pair combined for just 38 yards. So make way for the A-train. That's sophomore-to-be Alfred Morris, punishing tacklers as he bursts through the line. This is Morris again with a 19-yard touchdown run. How'd you like to tackle that guy? Get your ticket punch for a ride on the A-train. I just, uh, I took the handoff and my, um, fullback opened the hole up and, and I just run with the aim. That's what I coach teachers. Run with the aim. <laughs> Morris later added a 60-yard touchdown run. Most of his 146 yards came against the first or second team defense, which didn't surprise running back coach Dave Cerna. Uh, Morris wasn't the only relative unknown to experience success. Here's David Muniz with the first of his two touchdown runs. He rushed for 72 yards on 11 carries. And the Owls passing game, which sputtered at times with Rusty Smith, well, he didn't throw a touchdown pass, but back up Jeff Van Camp through two. Both the tight end Jason Harmon, who looks strong after sitting out last season recuperating an ACL tear. And yeah, you could put a little ketchup on that hot dog. But the big story is FAU's search for the big running back, and Howard Schnellenberger, he may have found one. For FAUAllaccess.com, I'm Chuck King.